Hi there, this is a quick tutorial for a couple of alternative methods for copying files to and from your iPad or iPhone. iTunes has a, a facility for you to move music and videos and things like that to and from your, your device. Um, I just connected my iPhone here. I have autoplay enabled, so that pops up this this window which allows me to open the device and view the files. If you don't have autoplay uh, enabled on your machine, you can just navigate uh, to my computer or computer uh, down to your Apple iPhone and to internal storage. That'll give you a DCIM folder and uh, that's a lot like a camera that you might have, digital camera. Just open that. There's a subfolder, open that and then here's all your images uh, as well as your movie files. Uh, that are on your device. So I'm just going to right click here on um, on image 14, copy that, and then here on my desktop I'm going to paste it. So now I've copied image 14 uh, onto my PC. Another way to move uh, files back and forth is uh, within iTunes itself. Um, lots of apps allow you to use and manipulate files. So I'm here in iTunes, and if I select my device, which is my, my phone, and go to Apps and scroll down, you can see there's this file sharing section. And this will identify any of your applications that allow you to share files. Uh, for example, Evernote does that. So if I wanted to uh, save a file off of Evernote, and save it down to my machine. I can just select the file and select Save to. If I wanted to add that uh, that image file, I think it was image 14, uh, to Evernote on my iPhone, I could click Add here and uh, scroll down and find that image 14 and click Open and then that adds it to uh, Evernote on my iPhone. Uh, other apps have those facilities also, and you can add or save files from those. So that's just a couple ways to um, move files on and off your uh, iPhone or iPad. Thanks.